with the Star Wars theme, the White Sox learned the force is with these Kansas City Royals. They swept the Sox for the second time this season at home. You know, we're, we're doing good right now as a squad, and I think the force is with us. <laughs> Star Wars fan? Nah. All right, Dyson, just play along for a minute. On a day when it was hotter than Tantooine, Danny Duffy wilted in the fourth inning and blew a 3-0 lead. It was so hot and humid, the air was heavy. He's a, a heavy sweater, you know, and not a heavy sweater that you wear, but a heavy sweater that sweats. Right. You know, I just think that he got to him a little bit, you know. What the hell are you doing? Somebody has to save our skins. Ned Yost called upon Chris Medlin, who tossed three and a third hitless innings. I just wasn't throwing strikes in the third and fourth, so. Um, Ned managed the game really well today, bringing in Chris. Being a part of this bullpen, I think uh, those are the kind of expectations that, that, that they have for those guys out there. And um, me being a part of it, I think I expect myself to, to, to do my job. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only hope. Ben Obi-Wan Zobris drove in the go-ahead run in the fifth inning, his ninth RBI in nine games. The Sox tied it. <laughs> But as is so often the case, the Royals answered immediately. You know, we've played those guys well. They got a tough pitching staff and a good lineup over there. And, uh, you know, I don't know what it is, but we figured out a way to get those guys. And we play some good ball right now. So uh, we just trying to take advantage of the opportunity and go up as many games as we can so we can rest guys. <laughs> Laugh it up, fuzzball. Chewy and his friends had their day, and now it's Johnny Cueto's turn. The new Kansas City starter with the fuzzy beard, will make his home debut Monday night against Detroit. Jason Lamb, Fox 4 Sports.